Welcome! In front of me is a Nokia 1.4 and today I'll show you how you can enable and set up the Do Not Disturb mode. So to get started you want to pull down your notification panel straight from the top and look for the toggle which looks like it is turned off for me by default. So if for you the notification panel has the same limited amount of options as it, it does for me, you want to click on this pencil icon right here. And in here we should find Do Not Disturb Mode Toggle somewhere, which that's right over here. So once you find it, hold it, then drag it over to the top, drop it, and when you go back you can now access it right here. So now that it's uh, visible in here, you can tap on it to immediately turn it on, or you can hold it, which I do recommend doing the first time around. Uh, this will take you to the settings where you will be able to customize how it functions. So we can select uh, who can call, call us, message us, we can select what kind of apps will be able to interrupt us. Uh, and we have also alarms and other interruptions, along with the last option for the schedule. So by setting up a schedule, you won't actually need to toggle it on and off. Just make sure that the schedule is turned on. And the way you set it up, so when you click right here, the way you set it up, this is def going to define when it will turn on and turn off on its own. So as you can see, the sleeping one turns on. Uh, all week long starting at uh, 10 p.m. till 7 a.m. So when this is enabled it's gonna do it for you you don't need to actually toggle it on. And we have some advanced options so uh, durations for quick settings and this just defines what happens when you press on the toggle in the notification panel and display options for hidden notifications or just uh, visual blocking. So once you went through all the settings and customize them to your liking uh, you can toggle it on manually by finding the toggle tapping on it and there we go it is now enabled and additionally if you're using a scheduled mode like I mentioned you don't need to toggle it toggle this on you can just keep it off as long as the schedule is turned on in the settings that's all you need to worry about so anyway if you found this very helpful and don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching